I got good news and bad news. The good news is Willow was finally released today, but the bad news, Willow just broke Brawl Stars in such a major way to the same degree as certain brawlers in the past, where they literally had to temporarily remove her from Brawl Stars. Now, I know here in the community, we throw around breaking the game quite loosely. However, this is no exaggeration. Taking a look on your screen, Willow actually right now, after a few hours upon her release, cannot be played physically. This actual prompt here is the second ever time we've been able to see this amongst the likes of Bonnie in the past, which was an incredible glitch at the time. She too was causing havoc to every single game she was playing in, I would say a little bit more flash than Willow's thing right now. But nonetheless, shortly after this crazy glitch was found on Bonnie, they had to remove her for quite some time in the game. Now, I currently don't have Willow unlocked or anything like that, so I'm curious to see if we can purchase Willow and then we'll be prompted to her not being available to be played. But I wanna go over the timeline in what actually happened this morning. Five hours ago, at the point that I'm recording this video, there was a short maintenance break before Willow was even released, fixing some sounds and visual effects as well as attack logic, where she can now break breakable objects. Shortly after the maintenance, she was finally released. Three hours ago, who lives in a dirty swamp under the pier? Willow, the mind control brawler, is now available. Now, I'm gonna be frank with you all. I wish I was awake for the next hour that would transpire and be able to experience gameplay because take a look at this. The very next tweet two hours ago, we are aware of some game crashing issues with Willow. We are investigating the possible issues and hopefully we'll have a fix for it soon. And then a follow-up from this tweet one hour ago, we will disable Willow from Brawl Stars for the time being until we fix it. Once we have a fix for that, we will let you know. As a consequence of that, Willow will probably be trending on Twitter, much like Bonnie some time ago. Breaking news. This never happens in these types of episodes. We actually have a tweet one minute ago. Maintenance fixing Willow. <laughs> she actually was trending. Oh my gosh, that's funny. So there's maintenance right now at the minute to try to fix Willow. Looks like right before the maintenance, but I just want to see if I could purchase Willow and see the unavailable here before we get kicked into maintenance. Okay, we're going to unlock her. Confirm purchase. Let's go. Willow, you game-breaking brawler. You, I love that about you. 10 out of 10 mythic brawlers, and here it is. Yeah, this brawler is temporarily not available. I'm so freaking happy we were able to see it before they actually fix it with, I'm assuming, the maintenance that just came out. But if you're trying to play her, you get this prompt. As you can see, this brawler is temporarily not available. Try another brawler. Pretty dang nuts, man. But as to what actually went down with Willow's mechanics causing crashes in the game, we can see from this example here from Ben during a live stream this morning for anyone who wasn't awake or available to be able to experience the bug. So during the stream, someone let Ben know that Willow was crashing the game with the super. As you can see, the lobbies are insane, dude. Just Willows at the Willows at the Willows. Full lobbies of them. It's like Edgar Apocalypse all over again. But he's desperately trying trying to get his super here in a lobby full of willows. Honestly, it's more so who's going to get the super first, and I don't think it was actually Ben who got the super. He's getting closer to it, and the game crashed. So, this would imply that other willows can break the game. It's not just you, which is a major issue. The same exact kind of issue that we had with Bonnie, where yes, she was crashing the game, but it was forcing other people's games to crash and causing problems for others in the game. But after he booted back into Brawl Stars, he noticed that he wasn't awarded any trophies for that match as well. So the bots didn't even take over. The game just flat out crashed and the game didn't count. Pretty wild stuff, if you ask me. Not as flashy as the Bonnie glitch where we got some crazy visual stuff going on with her character but still nonetheless stuff like this doesn't happen very often.
Now, as to why this actually ended up going down, there's a few fun theories because most of the community doesn't even know what's going on. I think the dev team are the only people that know right now if they're going into maintenance, they must have discovered the problem and are trying to fix it. But the similarities between the situation that we had with Gene upon his release and Willow, seeing that their mechanics are quite similar, right? You have this skill shot super when you shoot it off and land it on someone, it interacts with the other player in a bizarre way, a way that is a little bit foreign to the already in-game mechanics. There somewhere within that mechanic, I'm assuming the issue lies. It's so dang funny. Taking a look at a post over here on Reddit that I think paints the picture very, very well. Gene, <laughs> it's happening again. Now, I sometimes fail to realize when stuff like this happens because I really, really enjoy bugs and glitches. Playing this game for as long as I have, when stuff like this happens, it's something so outside of the usual processes here in Brawl Stars that it just piques my interest to a degree that's just kind of hard to explain it. It honestly gets me just as hyped when a new brawler would drop. It's just kind of exciting. However, it's definitely important to mention the seriousness of this situation here. Taking a look at a post on Reddit as well. Come on, man. I spent a lot of credits on her. It's definitely not a great feeling when a brand new brawler is introduced to the game and we can purchase her with our saved up credits or gems and then shortly after that she is disabled. Now I was going to get into speculation as to when I would assume she would come back but due to the recent tweet over here it appears that the dev team ended up finding the issue and are working on fixing it right now with the context being we are fixing Willow. So depending on how long this maintenance break lasts I'm assuming the fix will be out at that time. Now the last maintenance break that we ended up getting in Brawl Stars lasted a really long time so try to stay patient with this. It's kind of a double-edged sword element that we have here in Brawl Stars where things like this happen quite frequently in the game. We have bugs, we have glitches, sometimes brawlers can be introduced to the game and break it. So much more than other Supercell games to the point where I see a lot of people discussing that when they're saying what games they enjoy playing the most or other Supercell game discussions that I've seen in the past where they say Brawl Stars is a bit buggy and stuff like that. At the end of the day, mechanically, Brawl Stars is quite the complex game compared to the other Supercell games, so stuff like this is bound to happen. When we take a look at the dev team as a whole, it's kind of a small operation and the sole fact that they can't test out how the new brawler is going to function in a playable environment, much like we see from, for example, when new games go into beta. The sole reason a new game goes into beta in the first place is to get some actual testing, getting it in the actual hands of people to test how things can function. With a new brawler being released and the dev team's end of things, they really don't have that luxury. They can really only test so much with dev build-esque mechanics on their end before it's just launched into millions and millions of players hands. So again, stuff like this is just going to happen when it comes to Brawl Stars right now and in the future. But thankfully, we have a dev team that is super, super fast on these things. They are not a slacking dev team. We are in very, very good hands if they can act this quickly on certain issues that arise in the game. I knew we weren't going to be able to interact with the Willow glitch with the maintenance break. I'm happy I acted quickly, at least unlocking her and experiencing it on my end, because right now we are finally in maintenance with an estimated time of 55 minutes before the fix. So yeah, try to stay patient out there, everyone. It's never a great feeling when stuff like this happens, especially day one of a new Brawler's release, but stuff like this happens very, very soon. We'll be able to have some fun with this new character and see what she's all about here in Brawl Stars. But yeah, everyone, once again, I had other plans for this video here today. I've been cooking up something pretty dang special for you all for a couple days now, but crazy stuff has been happening every single day. As you all, all already know, one of my top priorities here on this channel is making sure you guys are in the loop on everything. So this definitely takes precedent over what I'm doing right now, but make sure to stay tuned for that video. It should be out here very soon. But a little bit more of a quick video, keeping you guys up to date with the more breaking issues at hand in Brawl Stars. Hopefully you guys are staying patient out there and enjoying yourselves during this maintenance break, I guess. But yeah, we'll be talking super, super soon. Have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day and we will see you in the next one. Adios and take care.